Hello and I am back with the very next video on the topic that we have started earlier that is partial differentiation. So let us take an example on partial differentiation. So the problem says if u is equal to x square y plus y square z plus z square x then prove that del u by del x plus del u by del y plus del u by del z is equal to x plus y plus z whole square. Okay. So we are given a function u which is a dependent variable. Okay. And we have to show this result. So the problems of proof that are very simple problems because it gives you an idea like from where you have to start and where you have to end. All right. So first of all, by looking at this problem, I just get an idea like I have to start with del u by del x. Then I have to find out del u by del y. Then I have to find out del u by del z. I would be getting three differentiation and then I have to sum of those things plus all right. Then I should get something like this. That is what this question demands. Okay. So let us start with this problem. We are given u. Let us differentiate partially with respect to x, y and z and try to get this result. Okay. So is the roadmap clear from where we have to start and where we have to reach? All right. So let us start with this. So u is given to us. Okay. U is given. So I can directly start with del u by del x. Before that, I need to write differentiating partially, differentiating partially with respect to x, y, and z respectively. We get so what I would be getting. I would be getting first of all del u by del x, del u by del x. When I am taking derivative of u with respect to x, I will definitely keep the term of y and z as constant. That's correct. So here we have the term of x. Yes. So y will be treated as constant and derivative of x square is yes, 2x. That's correct. Plus, is there a term of x over here? No. So this term will be treated as constant and its derivative is 0. Plus. Is there a term of x? Yes. So z square treated as constant into derivative of x is 1. Okay. Here because it was in multiplication. So I need to consider this. Okay. z square into. Here no term of x. So constant derivative is 0. Yeah. So what I would be getting then? This is 2xy plus z square. Okay. This is del u by del x. Now you find out del u by del y. Del u by del y. Now, differentiation of u with respect to, with respect to, yes, y. So x and z will treat as constant. Is there a term of y over here? Yes. So x square is treated as constant. Derivative of y with respect to y is 1 plus. Is there a term of y? Yes. So derivative of y square is 2y, z is constant as it is. There is no term of y over here, so 0. So we have now del u by del y as x square plus 2yz. Okay. Now I want you to find out del u by del z. Can you able to find out del u by del z? If you are taking derivative of u with respect to z, which term you will keep as constant? Yes, x and y. That's correct. So come on, find out. x and y are constant. Okay, there is no term of z. So I can directly write derivative of this to be 0. Plus, what about derivative of this with respect to z? y square is constant into derivative of z with respect to z is 1. Plus, this is x is constant and derivative of z square is 2z. So, what I am getting? y square 
plus 2xz. Okay? Say this is to be equation 1. This is to be equation 2. And this is to be equation 3. Now, I will go towards the question. Question demands for addition of these three. I already found out del u by del x, del u by del y and del u by del z. So, I need to just add. So, what I need to write on adding, on adding 1, 2 and 3, we get, so what I would be getting on adding 1, 2 and 3, left hand side add together with left hand side and right hand side with right hand side. So, del u by del x plus del u by del y plus del u by del z. So, that is the addition of left hand side. Now, try to add the right hand side. So, x square y square z square. So, I will write x square plus y square plus z square plus 2xy plus 2yz plus 2xz. Do you remember this? Can you identify this? This we have learned in elementary school level. Okay. In the 8th or 9th standard. What is this? Yes, this is the binomial expansion of x plus y plus z whole square. Okay. And if you are not getting anything after this, you can directly write from the result. Okay. That is what you can do at the most. Okay. So, after this, you just need to write down one thing is equal to x plus y plus z whole square. And this proves the result. So, this is what we have in this learning video. I hope uh, the things are very much clear to you. So, thank you for watching and enjoy learning mathematics. Thank you.